What's going on everybody? Rob here, aka Trev2323. 23, 23. Got me out here working on the snow plow. That's the snow plow right there. And then there's the no, that's the yeah, that's the snow thrower. That's snow plow. Look at that stack. Oh my god. Anyways, this is an aftermarket snow plow. I don't know what year it is. I picked it up for 75 bucks, I think it was. 75 bucks. Look at that. Four foot snow plow. Uh, not for a wheel horse. It was extended way out. Me and my son shortened it right here But then he had to make me some brackets now the other wheel horse They do clip on the same style underneath your axle is where your rear hitch hangs on. Okay, so what my son mocked me up was He mocked me up some plates that this goes on the bottom of the axle and this goes over the top of the axle and then with this plates they hold that in place right there plus I get the tilt from it all right so this is my first time putting these on so let me go ahead and put this on this is an aftermarket mock-up of a wheel horse plow all right and then I got to figure out how I'm going to chain up the front right here so let me this is just angle uh, iron that he welded together he gave me a spigot on the end or a little thing on the end a one inch metal piece on the end bolted in with two grade 8 bolts and this is what's gonna hold the back of the plow and the back of your plow is what pushes this axle is what pushes nothing else is held other than the back of this axle and then you have a chain or a cable to lift it up and down but your pressure comes from this axle right here all right, there's the aftermarket snow plow on the wheel horse. I gotta cut it back some. Look how long it is. I gotta cut this off right here. This right here, I can just move my hand. It's either gonna be left or right. This opens it up. And that's as far as far it goes to the left. Same thing to the right. I didn't turn the gas valve on but you see with the plow it does go good enough to the side to turn it I dropped my key over here I don't want to lose this I really don't want to glue it on yet though because I want to throw this anyways over there so now I got to be able to fit this in over there because the plow is already attached what I did to the back is there's brackets right here and brackets right here welded onto the axle those are onto the axle now this is the bottom piece that runs all the way to the top my son welded up some spindles welded up some spindles to go on right there so like I said, I already drug it backwards and it looked okay when I drug it backwards. So it's 75 bucks. I just really gotta get it to 
bit better. I gotta cut it down and shorten it back and then I think it'll fit perfect. <laughs>